Huh. Well, I'm recording this game again. Um, I know it hasn't been the longest wait for a part of this game, but the last time that I recorded this was uh, the day before Valentine's Day. Yeah, I I have plenty t to talk about in this video. Like, there's no shortage of commentary in this part. I have too much to say. Um, last time, I didn't really have way too much to talk about. Like, uh, what was it? Like, yeah, like, the boiler works in general. I didn't have way, way too much to say. Um, but oh god. Oh god, do I have plenty here. Um, but I am excited to see what this place is gonna offer. Uh, I don't think Luigi's Mansion has done, uh this kind of motif too, uh, too much. So I'm really excited to see what this game's gonna bring to the table, honestly. Cause you know, it's this game. Mario games usually get desert themes and museum and you know, uh, you know, stuff like this, right. Oh God. Ugh, when the candles lighting up is scary. Well, you know, it's gonna be a good time. Oh. Oh god, I really have to pay attention. <clears throat> okay. So, um, talking at the same time, me playing a game isn't usually that hard, because I'm good at it, but, you know, this place is all about traps, I would assume. So, wait, can I get the heart? Is it already gone? Okay, there it is. It was just, yeah, kind of around. Um... This music is a lot more lively than I thought it would be. Um, anyway. Uh, also, how do you explain this? Like, hieroglyphics? Is that is that the word? I don't even know what the word is. Some kind of tapestry. Depicting, uh, the, uh, you know, overall theme, obviously. Um, but yeah, oh god, that's great! <laughs> That kind of looks like, um, Alpha Dream Art or something, if that makes sense. I don't know. I mean, yeah, Mario RPGs usually tackle this kind of motif, right? Uh... Oh, man. That looks awesome. Uh, I know Sticker Star didn't do very good with, uh, well, I mean, anything. <laughs> but, uh... The puzzle aspect of uh, of uh, this motif was ridiculous, kind of. Oh god. Wait, what is that, a boo? Oh yeah, it is. It's like a marble or something. I wonder what i do with it. Shoot it at the snake head or some shit? Okay, there's the reticle. Um, I imagine this wouldn't do anything, but... Oh, it's like a balloon! Don't put it in the flames, then. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, time to explore this beast. Oh god, speaking of beast. Uh, but yeah, how, uh, how do I explain this? Um, so the day after I recorded part, it, well, it was 17 and 18, I did all the boiler works, like I said. Oops. The genie of the lamp. Um... Yeah, I was sick, like, literally the day after, and I'm really happy that I recorded those, th like, the the night before, because quite literally the next day after, I was all messed up. It was honestly one of the worst weeks of my life. Oh! Oh, God. It was a fake! Ugh, I'm trying to enjoy the scenery here. But... It's, uh, yeah, it's not gonna work out, I guess. It ain't real. Oh, hold on. Let me flash you real quick, good boy. I don't know why I said that. Um, yeah, um, so, I'm just trying to remember how it started. Oh, God. <laughs> I can see everywhere I slammed you. It's like footprints, but, you know, you're huge. Uh... Are you, wait, are you hidden? Where are you? Oh, money. There you go. Oh, maybe you're hidden in the sand somewhere. Actually. 
I wonder how far this goes down. Oh, I guess that answers my question. I'm bound to find something. Anything at all. Um, I guess while I'm looking for him, uh, I'll explain more. But yeah, um, I woke up and all of a sudden I just completely felt like shit. And I'm like, why is that? Um, I know I ate something the night before, but surely that couldn't have been it. It was just way too random. Um, oh, hey, there you are. Hey, you're flexing, huh? Like, oh, like literally you're flexing. Oh, God. I couldn't even, like, react. Jeez. For a big guy, you're pretty fast. Gotta say. Alright. Well, uh, let's just try and get some of this, uh, you know, uh, uncovered. I'm like, hey, I can kick your ass and get rid of some of the sand at the same time. Um, yeah, so, the next day I felt like shit, um... And the parts that I did was like it was like literally the day before all that, so that was that was kind of lucky. Like it sucked that it happened at all, but like I guess I'm happy that if it was gonna happen, it was the day after I recorded. So that's that, that you know that that's cool. I guess I'm in the sand. <laughs> that's kind of weird. Um, and I'm just trying to remember all the details because you know after stuff like that, you really don't want to remember. But for the sake of you guys, and just for commentary in general, I'm kind of interested in uh, what you guys would think about that. So, yeah. Uh, I, wonder, I wonder what i do with these. Probably, I don't know, I can't really do anything with them yet, probably, I don't know. Uh, anything, like, behind it? I don't know. That is so cool, though. Like, it's just like a wall, like... It, it, like, it gives the illusion that it's just infinite space or something. If that makes sense, I don't know. Uh, can't, the camera zooms in here, but I don't think there's really anything, you know, here. Yeah, probably not. I'm gonna go with a no on that one. I don't know what I'd do with this, uh, boo, though. I, I kind of have no idea. Part of me is interested to like put it in the fire, but I don't know. It would I, maybe it would, it would like destroy it or something. Uh, oh, I have to light that. Did you bring a light? No. Uh, you know that would that would be really funny if I could just shoot the plunger up there. It's like a bow and arrow in Zelda or something. Uh, oh, there's like a hole in the wall over there. Okay, you know what? I'm I'm just interested to see what happens. Probably nothing. I, I can't even see a reticle. There, there it is. Uh, just use gyro. Nope, nothing. Okay. Well, I'm gonna see what that is in, uh, in the wall. Probably like another fake thing. At least here it's obvious. Hmm. Not probably just something to. Oh, never mind. It is. I'm like, nah. Probably just suck something up or something. But no, it is. Uh, it's it's what I had to do. Oh. Damn. I can't even get access to it. It's like, hey, you figured it out, but how do you get to it? Is the question. Part two of the puzzle. Uh. Probably just made it worse. Now I'm even lower. It's like little sandcastles. Oh god. I haven't even made it into the thing yet. And already I'm pretty interested, man. I imagine you wouldn't, like, sift through all this sand inside. It's just like an outdoor thing. Whoa. Hey. I didn't even think about the possibility of a jewel being in the sand. And it's all snakes. Or... That's just saying it bluntly, but that's probably not the word. Um, yeah, so, um, I, I keep trying to go back to the sickness thing. I just, I don't want to remember it, damn it. It sucked. Um, like, the, the night of the 13th, like, after I recorded that, uh, my girlfriend brought home vegan chili. 
like uh, her work was gonna throw it away, but like it was overcooked or something. Oh, sorry, I destroyed your sandcastle. I'm sorry. I can't take it back now, though. It's <laughs> what's done is done. <laughs> oh God, now I have to find a bunch of you. Hey, I'll take your treasure too. Screw it, man. I don't even care. Whatever. Oh, the sand blocked them. That's great. That's kind of cool. <coughs> I didn't know that'd be a thing. Alright. I'll just uh, bait them out. Yeah, there you go. As soon as I destroyed another sandcastle, they're like, Hey, what are you doing? Alright, line up my shot. Yes, there we go. Two for baby. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um. Oh, yeah, he literally said, oh, yeah, alright, I forgot. You know, because it's been a while. Um. Yeah, so... Her work was gonna throw that away, but it's like, nah, bring it home, right? You know, food is food, right? You don't like to throw away food. I know I don't. Pisses me off whenever I do. Um, although part of me doesn't want, like, like if I'm full, I sometimes throw stuff away anyway, so that's me being a hypocrite, really. Um, but yeah, I ate it. And uh, trust me, this fits into the story. Um, but no, like, it, it wasn't the vegan chili. It wasn't that at all. Um, I know that that's a really random thing to bring up, but yeah, I, I ate that, and it was okay. Um, I had chips with it, just because I'm not used to vegan stuff. I mean, some vegan stuff is actually okay. But, you know, not my preferred, uh, choice. I wonder if I could, like, shoot the boo up there. But there's no reticle, though. Oh, wait. It's kind of a hit or miss, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, like, it stops eventually. Uh, gotta be really careful, though. Yeah, that's, like, the threshold of it or whatever. Oh! Popped the beach ball. Hey! There you go. Line it up. Oh, never mind. There you go. Go figure, the least powerful strobob did it. I mean, I don't know. They, they were closer, I guess, but still. It's like, come on. I wanted that first one to hit. Um, yeah, so later on, on Valentine's Day, because, you know, that's when it happened, obviously, I got, like, the flu in 2019 and on uh, April Fool's. And then I get really sick on Valentine's Day. Like, fuck off. Like, really? It has to be, like, that kind of shit? Like, being sick is bad enough, but on those days? Really? You just gotta do me like that? Um. Oh, yeah, what's this about? Oh, it's another jewel. It's weird doing this. Because, like, below you, you get rid of the sands, and then you land, like, further down. Like, the game isn't used to that or something. Uh, okay, I want to get past this and then continue talking. I know I have to light that somehow, but I just don't know, you know, how. Something in that chest, maybe? I have no idea. I mean, nothing's going on right now, like, really, so it's a good time to bring it up, I guess, but... Like, the story, but still. Um... What happened later that day? Like, nothing way too bad happened on Valentine's Day, but I knew something was going on. Like, my head was pounding, my body was weak, I was getting the cold sweats. Um, shortly before I got sick, my girlfriend got sick, and one of her symptoms was the cold sweats, too. I forget the, the actual, like, term that they use. I said it before, but I just forgot. Um, so, yeah, overall, I, I just started feeling like shit. Uh, wait, maybe bring it down with the plunger. Nope. That's not the answer. Damn. But the second day, though, on the 15th, that's when shit hit the fan. And by shit, yeah, I mean shit. Not literally hitting a fan, though. But yes, there was, uh... There was, um... Leftovers involved, if you know what I'm saying. Came out the one end. 
So, um, okay, you know what? No, I'm not, I'm not going to continue the story until I actually figure this out. Like, the snake doesn't do anything. But, like, does anything happen if I go over to the one of these guys? Oh my god, are you f <sighs> And then do the other one, or is that it? Great. Great! That's all I had to do. That's all I had to do! Are you kidding? You know what? I'm gonna say I picked the right one. And screw that one. Wow, I can't believe I just did all that. I could have just walked over to one of them. Oh, well, whatever. I picked the right one, I guess, so that's good. Um, that is legitimately creepy. It's like death, like legitimately. Ugh, sounds sad, too. Um... Yeah, so, um... Oh, there's a button there. Yeah, so basically what happened was... Is that, uh, the next day... Um... I had to, like, I had to really go, you know? And... Like, I was just, like, like I woke up, like, early in the morning, like, really early. And... My body's like, screw you. Like, I would go to the bathroom and then I wouldn't have to go again. But then I go back to bed. Oh, oh, you have to get out. Go, you know, go on the toilet again. I would sit there, and it just, it wouldn't, like, like, the position of my body, like, it just wouldn't pass through, you know? And I was just stuck in this perpetual existence of mine. This, my ex existential crisis. Oh, God, I thought someone was just gonna come out of there. Unlike when I was sick, ha ha ha! Uh, it really did suck, though. And so, I had my girlfriend make me a tea, like a really special one. Uh, what was it? Like a lemon and ginger tea. And, uh, then and only then did it, uh, you know, d did the process begin. And I was in the washroom for about three hours. Two and a half to three hours is how long I was in there for. But then after that, my back was in... A huge amount of pain probably because I was just sitting in the same position for how long speaking of which I wonder how long this thing has been here for oh god that's the next um, portrait ghost right Ooh. I don't know Oh no! Oh god. <laughs> god, I just keep on going down. This ain't no pet of a hundred trials though. God, okay, I would be legitimately freaking out here. Like, no tomorrow. Look, you hear it? The signal cut out all of a sudden. What's wrong? You fell down a sand pit? Ha, a classic trap you'd find in a pyramid. Yep, or inside a pyramid. Luigi, you've got to find an escape route and watch for more traps. Yeah. Well, first of all, let's just get rid of all these spiders. Oh, God. Yeah, um... A lot of fears at the same time. Claustrophobia. Arachnophobia. Um, you know, just thinking that you might never get out alive. You know, there's that too, right? Um, well, I imagine I would have to suck all this up. Or, I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Like, I would lose, like, lose my footing or something. Uh, so yeah, and then my back really hurt. And, uh, it was to the point where I couldn't even sleep. Like, I would always sleep in the same position. But, nope, my body was not allowing me to sleep. My back hurt legitimately that much. Like, that was by far the worst thing ever in terms of my back. Like, you hear about these commercials where it's, like, all about back pain and stuff like that. 
but holy shit. I didn't realize how bad back pain actually was or how bad it could be until that happened. I was a prisoner of my own body. No, oh, Luigi didn't do the, oh huh, yeah. Okay, there you go. Yeah. That's what I was talking about. Uh, yeah, so I just took a shitload of medicine over time and, um, you know, I, like, I had a runny nose too. Like, I always felt like I had to cough out, you know, leftovers. Phlegm, basically. Yeah, it was awful. It was, uh, one of the worst weeks. Oh, oh, there's a spider. I'm like, why is Luigi looking so terrified? That's the way out, right? Um, probably have to blow some of the sand over here. There you go, that makes sense. Uh, I imagine this, like, there's a time limit. Like, you'll eventually get, a, uh, you know. Like, eventually you'll drown in the sand, if that makes sense. Uh, is that good? Yeah, that's good. Oh god. Another spider. Um, yeah, so that's basically it with that. Uh, it was really- oh shit. Hey, we haven't used Gooigi in a while, have we? Go on, bud. Take the bait. Oh shit, can I even make it? Oh yeah, I can. Nice. Hey, hey, there you go. Try and get me now, bitches. All right, cool. Um, right, there we go. All right, climb my way out of here, Castlevania style. Oh shit, can I use the flashlight while doing that? No, I can't. Yeah, speaking of Castlevania, a lot of actions are, uh, you know, like, not allowed when you're, like, climbing. Whether it be a ladder or stairs or, you know, in this case, obviously in Castlevania's case, stairs. Ah, knock, knock. Oh, right, this is like the second uh, part of it. Okay. Looks like there's a door overhead. Maybe you can get back to the surface through there. Find a way to that door, Luigi. All right, um, I mean, I guess this would be a good time to stop this part. Um, right, makes sense. Um, but yeah, I uh, definitely have more to discuss uh, the second half or the second part of the third. I don't know how many parts this part, like this uh, floor will be. Um, but yeah, uh, that was um, from Valentine's Day until like the next, um, what day did Valentine's Day fall on, actually? It was Friday. Right, so basically, like, Thursday or Friday of the next week. Uh, 20th or 21st. Yeah, finally got better. But, yeah, it was complete shit. It was awful. Um, yeah. So, I, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, continuing on the tomb. Tomb Raider. All, only it's not Tomb Raider, it's Luigi's Mansion. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then.